Okay, I'm gonna make a district, uh, descriptive video on my um, diaphone or air horn, whatever you want to call it. Uh, the parts you need is a um, 12 volt solenoid sprinkler valve. Mine is three fourths. Um, you also need, well, depending on how much you want, uh, you need a three fourths um, coupling um, and an angle elbow. Uh, mine goes three fourths to half inch. You can use whatever you want. Um, your horn can be anything. You can use PVC buckets, heating ducts, anything. Um, and then you need uh, three fourths to half inch if you want, or you can go three fourths. But um, you're gonna have to get down to a, a one fourth. So then I got some uh, just PVC elbows because this is weak, so I use this as a brace. Then at the end, I have a half inch uh, threaded to a three fourths, um, a nipple to a um, three fourths ball valve, uh, so you can open it and close it. Uh, not so for to the air compressor. I didn't have a uh, um, half inch uh, bushing, which you would want instead. Uh, you'd want to go from non-threaded to threaded with a a half inch to three fourths pushing to put the nipple onto and I just tape that on. It's not very strong. Um, that's pretty much all you need. You can assemble it any which way you want to. Uh, you can do it like the regular diaphones. Um, have a pipe going upwards and then have an elbow going up to the valve and then have another or have the valve at like that and then have the horn popping out that way. Um, so that's pretty much all there is to it. Um, then you'd also need a 12 volt transformer or a battery, whatever you want, to run it. And then if you want to, you can go that extra mile and build the timer for it.